What's up guys and welcome to the Crew Motor Fest. So we are here on Oahu and we are going to be taking on some of the playlists that we're going to see later on this year when the game comes out. The, uh, the closed beta just dropped today. Very excited to hop on here. You guys know I did an early video last week, or I guess earlier this week. And uh, that was through like a, a streaming platform. I was playing it over Parsec or whatever. So like I didn't actually have the game on my machine, couldn't play it in 4K and stuff, but uh, we're back. And we have the actual game now, the actual beta. Playing it locally. No lag, full graphics. It's gonna be good. The NSX, baby. Dude, these montages are insane. Made in Japan. So this is going to be like an eight race playlist that we go through and we made sure you discover do a all bunch of events. The Japanese drivers have to offer. Okay. First event is available. And it looks like we've got uh, another six after that. So it's, it's seven events in total. Six feet have been unlocked. Five photo ops available. Fast travel to container has been unlocked. All right, so this is kind of how you progress through the story mode. I guess, I, to be honest, I'm not 100% sure, but we're gonna knock these out. So Kyusha Spirit is gonna be our first event. We're gonna head out there. First race. Let's get after it. We brought Japan to you. There's a special gathering tonight at the Japanese temple. The start of a whole new experience. Here's what to expect when getting there. A traditional Japanese summer vibe and lots of Kyusha cars. Meaning iconic, classic and made in Japan. On top of this, expect some exciting encounters. Dude, this game is gorgeous. I love this. So let's head up into the mountains. To introduce you to an authentic Japanese racing experience. Don't worry, you'll meet them soon enough. All right, we made it. First event, first race of the Crew Motor Fest, Kyusha Spirit. Let's get into it. Loaned vehicle, the Honda NSX. Objective to reach top three. Got the Eclipse out here. That's something I haven't seen in a long time. Come on, baby. Show, show me Godzilla. We got Godzilla out here. RX-7. Ooh, there's the R-34. Dude, this is lit. Shingo, Ren, Hinata, Toji, the pack. I feel like we're in a Fast and the Furious movie right now. The first one. Try this guy, then. Getting loaned in NSX for this event. All right, here we go. First race of the playlist. Let's get after it, baby. I've, I've been looking forward to this game for so long, dude. I mean, the, you know, the, the preview was good, but to be able to actually play it locally and not have any lag or anything, hey, it's exciting. We're going for some proper Japanese street racing. Let's show them, guys. Gotcha. Got it. Sure. Absolutely yeah. flying here. I did, I'll be honest, and uh, hopefully I can help some of you guys out. I had a very hard time getting this thing to work. I'm playing on PC. I guess consoles are, are performing really well, but something about OBS the game doesn't like, so I had to downgrade yeah, my OBS. Show you how it's done, but we don't do free tours here. You gotta play your part and give us a bit of a challenge. No pressure at all. Yeah, don't scare the kid, brother. If you had OBS on your computer, it was dropping to like five frames a second. So I, I went to OBS version 28.1 or 28.10.0 or something like that. Are you familiar with the It's working driving? perfect now. The MSX is in your regular streetcar. It was made back in the 90s to stand neck and neck with the likes of Ferrari and Porsche. You sound just like Shingo. Dude, I love this. 
So we've got kind of a story, but we're also learning. He beats us with his NSX. We won't hear the end of it, right? I don't even want to think about giving Shingo the satisfaction. Better focus and win this thing, then. I don't know if there's much you guys are going to be able to do. It kind of seems like this is uh, pretty set in stone. Got a nice solid lead heading back up into the mountains. Dude, look at the, the fairy lights and stuff. By the way, do you know what NSX stands for? New sports car experimental. Really? I wasn't asking you, Hina. I mean, yeah, I, I love that we're actually getting some, some fun facts and things along with the racing and the story and everything. I'm curious how this is all going to work. So obviously this is the beta. None of the, the progress will transfer over. Are these going to be more linked in the full game or is it literally just going to be like each playlist is complete standalone? There's no like main storyline. You're just getting a, a bunch of bits and bobs all over the place. Either way is, is cool, but... on the road, Hina. Coming back down the mountain here. Dude, the handling feels really good. I've, I've, it's obviously the first race, and I, I feel like I've, I've got a pretty good handle on the drifting. I don't... I don't think we have, like, a drift spec or tires or anything, so we can't really keep it going. I'm gonna see what happens. Okay. If you hammer the e-brake, it's not a good idea. Take a look inside the NSX here. Oh my goodness, dude. This is a good looking game. I get, this is a vibey game, dude. I, I get like Forza Horizon mixed with heat. Need for speed heat. It's been so long since I played the Crew 2, I can't really remember. I see a lot of people saying, oh, so this is like the Crew 2 in Hawaii, but. Got a first place there. We'll take it right off the bat. Get some XP. Make some money. Yes, sir. Started off with 100k in our bank account. So made 13 there. Getting some parts that we're going to be able to equip on our cars. Of which we don't really have much yet. Just this S2000. A little bit beat up. But, well um, Let's move on to the following event. All right. We got our GPS car leading the way. The pack is waiting for you there. And is willing to show you some more of the racing culture. Dude, I the the first person view is good. This is this is solid. Feel like I'm letting my hair down. Also called Tokyo Bayshore Route or Route B is a famous stretch of highway for street racers. Almost every racer in the 80s and 90s knows about it. I'm gonna set up like a, a blow dryer in front of my monitor. I'm just gonna feel the wind hit my hair. Even notorious racing groups like the Midnight Club cut their teeth here. The and Midnight that's Club. What slightly inspired our next event. Yeah, dude, I love the interior view. All right, event number two, Wangan Spirit. Also, love that everything is destructible. Like these walls, you would think that'd be hard, you know, invisible walls that you bounce off of. No, you can just go right through the barricades. Objective is to reach top three. Bringing this Tokyo Midnight Street Racing. Ooh, we're in the R34. Stop it, baby. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. I've been wanting a new racing game so bad, dude. I feel like it's, it's been dry lately, bro. We need... We got, what, Forza Motorsports coming out soon, right? I mean... Hey there. Word in the street is that it's you should have like a real hasharia with my NSX. Got me interested. Well, then I believe you're in for a treat. Oh, yeah. oh god! Bring it on. So dude that loaned us the NSX is up there in second place. We're gonna have to catch up to him. I just realized we didn't even use nitrous in the uh the show continues, kid, first race. Watch out. You're driving Ren's skyline this time, and there's no word to tell you how crazy she is about that car. Can't blame her. The R34 is a legend. It's a kaiju. She's a kaiju, alright. She's got her in the, the bayside blue as well. Absolutely love this thing. Dream. To own one of these for sure. Here we go, baby. It's a powerful car that takes skill to control. Yep. Ren spent years taming that beast. That car got nicknamed Godzilla for a reason. So basically, you crash Ren's car, better leave the planet. I mean, I think we're a little bit past that point, but... I'll do my best to limit the damage going forward. Let's go, baby. Come on. 
Get after it. We got an RX-7 to beat in front of us. Try to take him around the outside. Yes, sir. Yeah, picture the Tokyo Bayshore route with one thing in mind, never slowing down. Dude, this is such a vibe with all the dragons and the neon and stuff all over the place. I was saying that in our preview video. I love that... I mean, it's an arcade racer. It doesn't take itself too seriously. But it's still kind of rooted in realism. You have, you know, some mechanical stuff you can mess with. Upgrade parts and things. Like, I, I don't know. I feel like it's a good mix. It's not too serious. But it's also... In a Wangan race, you gotta go serious fast, enough. Friend. Well, guys, I don't think it's gonna be a problem. This is the skyline we're talking about. I'm thinking we might have to up the difficulty a little bit. We're on medium. We may have... Uh, Undersold ourselves. Oh my goodness, dude. All the cherry blossom. Where are the cherry blossoms at? How are we getting cherry blossom leaves flying? I mean, I like it. It's a nice effect, but. These dragons are massive. You got a wish to make? It's a left hand drive, R34. Oh my gosh, dude. This, this route is ridiculous. Just slaloming down the coastline. Try to get a little a little drift in there. Kind of dipping the front wheels off. Call me Checo, baby. Man, I, that was that terrible in practice today. During a midnight race, supposedly because he was dazzled by the moonlight. Oh, shut up. I remember that. 86%. Ooh, look at the reflection. Dude, that's so cool. We got the reflection on the, the moon out there while our people are talking to us, referencing it. I like that we've got a little bit more personality in it than just racing. Who knows, maybe that'll get annoying, but seems like a fun idea. 96% of the way through and there's the finish line, baby. Ooh, caught a clip in the, the front corner there. Skyline once again showed its supremacy. I mean, that's kind of looking like Paul's after he jumped the bridge. Too fast, too furious. Got a 328, seven seconds ahead. Second place, we'll take it. Time to up the difficulty a little bit though. Bumped our difficulty up the expert. All right, here we go. Next event coming right up. We got the Hanama Bay Slalom. So we're gonna be, oh, just going to the correct size of the gates. Easy enough. Car's kind of in the way for us there. We're all right though. That's our, oh, we, we needed more speed, huh? Take this around the outside. Should be able to get him. Let's go. Woo, we needed more speed at the start. We were a little bit. We call these passes toge. There's even a toge style of racing. We're a little bit too, uh, ooh, objective complete. Beautiful. A little bit too far behind on the, the or uh, too close the to the starting line, I think. Behind on speed. close as we could get to Japan. So we figured it would be a good place to teach you. Sounds good to me. We're going to make our way up the mountain. Look at the lush jungles of Hawaii, baby. I love this. Everything's so bright and green and blue and everything else. Just a striking mix of saturation. Oh, and one last thing. A Togo race usually features only two races. You got it. You're in for a duel. A duel. So this is going to be a 1v1. I am always up for a challenge. Toge Spirit. I mean, come on, dude. This is the most beautiful car ever made. One of. It's... it's if it's not the most, it's got to be close. Look at the lines. Look at the edges. Look at everything about this. Here we go. Just you and me. Hayato. See what you got. The Miata. All right. It's just you and me this time. Why don't we put the whole festival euphoria on hold for a while and get a proper face off? Let me show you what Toge is all about. So this is... Toge is, is drifting. It, we're, we're drift... Uh, it's a point-to-point -point race, though. I don't think we're, like... Drifting for style points. I, I, I'm not earning anything. I think we're just 
I've seen what you can do. Drifting to keep speed up. I'm relaxed, baby. Professor about to become the, uh... I was gonna say protege, but that doesn't make sense. Protege about to be become the professor. You just wait and see. The key to Toge is being able to balance the brake and gas pedal at every turn. One wrong move and you're out. Here we go. Big one here. Ooh! Okay. Yeah, you could actually get sideways in Toge. I wonder if this is like, is this a wheel setup? Like a tire setup that we have? Easy, but when you pull it off, you feel like the greatest driver alive. Dude, this is sick. Got him in our rear view. He's he's trying to eat our lunch. Got to turn turn left to go right, turn right to go left. Let's go. We're hanging hanging him back there. This is sick, man. It's like we're we're in Tokyo Drift up here in the the mountains of Japan learning how to drift. Tonight, your ride is a third gen 2002 Mazda RX-7. Lightweight, compact, a sick rotary engine and one hell of a look. That's Tanada's car, and she seems pretty confident you can beat me with it. Let's prove her wrong. I don't know about all that, fam. You seem to be pretty far back there. He's not that far behind. He's he's one mistake behind Trev. One tiny mistake. Maybe try a little a little e brake just to kick that that tail end out. Dude, this is sick. Coming. Little nitrous. Gets tricky at high speed. Make sure you don't lose control. Woo! Getting a bit aggressive with it. Flaying that tail around, baby. Go, 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 go. Is he on us? No, he's not on us. We're good. Be careful here. Watch that wall. Dude, this is, it's actually really hard. Like, I, I, I think there's something here though. Like, I, obviously this is my first time trying it. Oh, we're going into the wall. We'll call that a drift tap. Um, and now it's right on us. Down. That's the best and also the toughest part, so stay sharp. Use our nitrous. Probably not the Trev. Why would you switch mid-turn? That's like the the worst thing you can do in a racing game. Come on, baby, get it back. He's there, but we're fine. Um, the physics feel good though. Like I, I I don't quite have the linking down yet, but I can definitely see. I, I think we need more speed. To be honest, I think the speed is is really kind of one of the biggest parts. Once you do get the feel for it, I feel like it's it's gonna be. You know, pretty cool the the lines that you're gonna be able to put together and stuff. I also kind of like that they built it into a race form, so it's it's more about your your speed and less about drifting just for the sake of drifting. It's more like using drifting to aid you in your corners. Looks like we've got one straight left. Launch the fireworks, baby. That's another dub. All right, not too bad. And back in the S2000. On to the next one. Just shown us how well you could use drifting techniques in a race. Now that you're all warmed up, how about a full on drift event? Oh, so there's multiple types of drift events. That was a point-to-point -point race where we were using drifting, and now I think we're going to go to something a little more traditional where it's all about throwing shapes and all about, uh, you know, increasing your score, staying sideways. I hope you've liked the RX-7, because you'll be driving it again during this challenge. Except this time, she'll be waiting for you all modded and upgraded. Ah. You've seen traditional Japan. Now it's time to enter the modern age. Beautiful. Red, the contrast is stunning. I don't know, man. This is this is pretty cool. How like your your GPS is is a character, you know? She's guiding you through this. She's referencing the events that you've been through. I don't This is a unique take on a racing game. And I I quite enjoy it so far. Here we go. Ibisu style. Drift to gain points and try to get the best score. You need to maintain your speed to keep drifting. Do so keep accelerating and use nitro when needed. Turn too much and you're going to lose speed. Too little and you won't drift. Try to find the right balance. So this is going to be all about holding those strong lines. Try to, you know, not too much, not too little. Find the right spot. Okay. 
It's just us. Ooh. Looking like Hans. They, they, so many references to movies and things. Got the full, uh, what, what is this? Uh, a veil slide? Veil side body kit, I think. Here we go. Longer the distance travel, the more points are earned. Ah, oh, this is a figure hey, eight. Chad, it's me, Hinata. Incredible, you did beat Hayato in that toga duel. I knew it. There's something about you. Hayato is one of the best racers I know. Kudos. Starting to get the feel for it. I kind of wish we had more room to run, to be honest. I wish we could we could keep more more speed up. Come on, you're almost done. Push that beauty to its limit. You have my permission. Oh my god, no. Dude, okay, we I think we had to get honestly more sideways than we had been. I you don't lose as much speed as I thought you were going to. We got it with 10 seconds left. I thought we were gonna lose it when we tapped the wall back there, but we're we're good to go. Okay. We got some work to do on drifting. I'm not gonna lie to you, but we got 65,000 points and we got a pass. We'll take it. That is a beautiful vehicle. I can't wait for the full game, man. I am sad that none of this progress is gonna carry over, but it's okay. Just gonna have to replay them. I'll probably replay them off screen when the full game comes out. So we'll just grind. We'll start with a nice bankroll or something. I don't know. We'll, what a we'll win. See. The best of many, I am sure. Drifting is a popular racing style in Japan, but drag racing also gets its fair share of gearheads. There's a drag spot set up not too far from here. We've got drag racing in this. Are we gonna have to like shift gears at a certain time and stuff, or is this just hold the gas? This runway is one of the best places to drag race on the island. Warm up your engine and don't blink. This will be a quick one. Dude, I love how varied everything is accelerate to warm up your tires step of the gas when the lights go green then keep accelerating and press rb to gear up at the right time dude i love stuff i i play so many mobile racing games that do this oh i love it gonna beat 12 8 so we want to get our tires warm react well shift at the right time get those perfect shifts drag spec r34 on the slicks we've got the the wheelie thing on the back so we can't can't end up flipping upside down. Run one. Here we go. Keep the gauge in the green zone. Trying to get it up there. Keep the tires warm. Beautiful step of the gas and the green lights. Got him. Beautiful start. Got to get our shifts. A little bit early on the shifts there. I think we can go a little bit better. We want to give it a little bit more time. But look at that. 278 miles an hour. 12, 6, 5, 6. I want to get full perfect all the way through. We had a really good start on that last one. Oh, we've got... Shoot, I messed it up. We've got nitrous. I didn't realize we've got nitrous. I actually double tapped the upshift. That was... That was... I mean, it was faster. 12.306. We, I think we can get 10 seconds. Can we go again? We've got one more run. Don't mess this up, Trev. I don't know when you use the nitrous. Like, is it probably like third gear or something? So we aren't having to shift gears too fast. Here we go. Too early. Perfect. Go and nitrous. Little bit early on that first shift, but honestly, overall, pretty solid there. 11 9. We got it under 12 seconds. We'll take it. Shaved it up another third of a second off from our best. That's fun. That's really fun. And to think this is all just Japanese themed races. And there, there are so many varied types of playlists. We can't really get a taste of modern Japanese car culture without some proper urban racing and seriously modern customs. upon Alulu at night should set the perfect stage for these final races Motorfest has prepared for you. Sounds good to me. Let's get after it. The city just feels alive, man. Prepare like it for a wild run. The pack hasn't shown you all their moves yet, and I believe they're ready to put on quite a show. Expect top-tier upgrades and expert driving. Sounds like a plan. We're almost there. Show them once and for all that you have what it takes. 
Is this the end, Kanjo style? We've we've used all their car. We didn't use the Miata, but we've used all their cars so far. Seem to be flying through the missions without opposition. I did just um. Yeah, we can increase it. I did just bump it up. I bumped it up to I think four out of five, so we might be on five out of five difficulty now. We'll see. Objective is to reach the top three, but yeah, it, it feels alive. Like all oh, the drive guitars riding everywhere. Obviously, when we're out of the beta, there's going to be even more. You're going to have all all these. You know, online racers with their custom cars and stuff riding around. You've got your GPS talking to you. You've got other characters in the game that you're interacting with, barring their cars and stuff. It's like, it truly feels like you're a part of the car scene. It's some sort of an underground, you know, club. Here we go. And the Evo. This is what you were waiting for when you signed up for the Made in Japan experience. Out of this world, customs owning the city. Let's see what we can do. By your wish, everybody's car is on top of their game, especially your new ride, Toji's Mitsubishi Lancer Evo X. Yeah, Toji's the craziest customizer of us all. He loves his cars, big and mean. Love that you can see the interiors and stuff, and you can look around and okay. Should probably keep my eyes on the road, but the fact that you can like look out the windows and it's, I don't know. There's a, a high level of pop. It just it's, it really puts you in in the game I feel I really feel like I'm in it here come on baby we got to focus up Trev we need a top three we got lap and a half to do it Evo X or previously known as concept X and prototype X is the final form of the Lancer evolution series it's the most technologically advanced Evo ever another JDM gem you're welcome Toji would say it's the best of them all I mean, I don't know about the best of them all, but they are pretty sick, not gonna lie. Whatever they did to my difficulty, they made it a lot tougher, that's for sure. Come on, baby. Up at a P4. I kinda like it, though. I wanna be challenged. Don't hit your nose on that storefront, Trev. Good stuff. I feel like they're... Is this a shortcut? Yes. I, I hope there are shortcuts in this game. Gotta love it. A good shortcut in a racing game. All right, that's lap one down. We're looking pretty good. The front three are starting to kind of run away with it a little bit. Doesn't have a legit reverse gear. It has two forward gears working together to make the wheels rotate in the opposite way. Cool, huh? And that's how you save on weight. Precisely. Really? Bro, little tidbits like that. Like I'm, I'm gonna pull that out in a conversation, and somebody's gonna tell me I'm crazy. It's like, no, sorry, bro. I played the crew. It's crazy too, cause I, I mean, I don't want to be insulting, but like I've always enjoyed the crew games in the past, but I never really like truly fell in love with one like this. Like I am genuinely having a blast. I love when I did the preview. What a race. A Motorfest crew knows how to throw a party. Don't get too excited. You're just a host in that fantasy. Watch out. Hosts can be dangerous, Mrs. Abernathy. Hey, I got that ref. Nerds, both of you. I don't get it. But when I did the preview event, like, it, I, I had a ton of fun. And now, like, I mean, we've been playing. I've been playing for the last 40 minutes or so. Just absolutely having a blast, dude. This is great. Music is good. Cars are epic. Customization is, is off the charts. Like, I... I'm... I was excited for this game because I wanted a new racing game to play. But now I'm... I'm really excited for this series. It's now or never. So it's looking like we're going to come home with this P3. I'm okay with that. We were chasing him. I feel like our start was a little bit rocky. We might have been of a... ...with a special Toji Custom. And you just showed you're totally worthy of that car. Might have been able to improve on that if we had a better start, but we'll take it. I like that you can still pass even if you don't get first. That is one thing that drives me crazy about racing games when it's like... You have to get first, and you always end up just blowing people out. It's not that exciting of a race. Last event, right there. You'll be racing amongst the whole pack this time. So we got you covered with a special car. Have fun. Covered with a special car. With the Toyota Supra Ryujin Edition. The final race of the playlist. Dude, this is freaking sick. I... This is sick. This is sick. 
Oh, <laughs> bro, what is that? The pack Shinjuku style. These cutscenes are what make it for me. I mean, the gameplay feels good. The physics feel good. The racing feels good. I hope I can get a hang on the drifting. I know our drifting was a little bit weak, but the, the cutscenes, I wouldn't say there's a great story here. It's not like there's, you know, I, I don't really care that much about the characters. There's no development or anything that we've seen so far. Who knows what the finals this is the final looking race. like. All together this time. You guys ready? You bet. I like that they're there, but the- <laughs> Okay, we're dealing with a real troublemaker. I'm just die bombing corners, baby. I don't care. The 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 cutscenes and like the the mashups to the music and stuff is just insane. All right, Trev. We showing you around, my friend, and you definitely fulfilled your end of the bargain. Could probably drive a little bit nicer. Not even once. Yeah. Okay. You kind of did a good job. There's clearly a spot for you in the group whenever you decide to come to Japan for some more action. Not gonna lie, this difficulty is tough. Like we we gotta we gotta lock it in here, Trev. We're gonna have to focus up if we want to be able to pass this. Let's. Let's race okay, nice. You've got talent. This is getting interesting. Try to take some shortcuts where we can. I know you don't have to actually go through the checkpoints fully. Like you can kind of, you can you can cheat them a little bit, even more so than Forza. Like you don't even have to hit the, the ribbons. What a ride. You can go outside of them by a couple feet. Shoot, dude, these two guys in front. I, we might not be able to beat them. I, I think we might have gotten a little bit too far off at a left field at the start. We'll see. I still, are we just, do you just collect nitrous over time? Or is it based on like drifting and drafting? Or how do you get nitrous? Because we need a whole heck of a lot of it. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I, uh, I had to restart here. We're on the final lap again. I had to really focus. Like it, it, it gets a little tough at times. We're we're in a good spot here, though. We only need top three. I would like to try to try to get first if we can, but I feel like we were we were messing around a bit towards the star back there. I don't know if your damage affects your your car and the performance or what, but come on, get him, get him, get him. Let's go. Let's punch it. I'm down. Don't have to tell me twice. But yeah, I don't know. I, I a little bit of wall there. You like it's it's a little bit more strategic than than meets the eye. You know, we've got these ridiculous started. body kits. Neon lights, floating dragons. Like it looks super arcadey, but it's actually That's some excellent driving. It's actually pretty tough. And there we have somehow we just absolutely blew him out of the end. Not sure how that works, but driver. This was made in Japan for you. And a great deal of adrenaline for us. Awesome driving. Dude, that was sick. That was, and that's one playlist. There's a Porsche playlist. There's a tour playlist. There's a, there's so many different playlists. An old school playlist. Beautiful. You've yet to claim your reward, driver. So do we? We ended in Waikiki here. We go back to the crate and I think we get a, a reward so we can fast Hi travel. Welcome back on this side of the Pacific. Is it gonna give us a car? It gives us the Supra? Oh my god. These cutscenes are what make this game so special. Look at this! You've got a super running through the forest of Hawaii with some crazy... I don't even know what to say, dude. This is freaking lit. This is lit. That's a playlist complete. We got new challenges, a custom mode, $75,000, and a Supra. Can move on to the next playlist. We have the um, 
the the Hawaii Scenic Tour. We also, I think, I mean, I get. We, let's let's just go do this one. We're gonna work on the Bronco. Let's go. I'm down. All right. I'm gonna see you guys in our next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Dude, this this is really good. I'll see you there.